The phrase, lightning never strikes the same place twice, is commonly used to refer to an unusual event that is unlikely to happen again. But if that is true, then why does our TV tower get struck by lightning multiple times per year? First, we have to talk about how lightning forms. The first thing needed for lightning is a thunderstorm cloud, which is just a warm column of rising air that condenses into a cloud. Thunderstorm clouds contain a mixture of water droplets and ice crystals, which collide numerous times throughout a storm's lifetime. Although each collision only produces a small charge, the sheer number of collisions generates a substantial electrical charge over time. Generally, a thunderstorm cloud will have negative charge in the low portion of the cloud and positive charge at the top of the cloud. A thunderstorm cloud overhead attracts positive charge from Earth's surface because opposites attract. The closer the distance between the opposite charges, the stronger the attraction becomes. Eventually, the attraction becomes so strong that it reaches a breakdown point, and this is when lightning forms. The attraction of opposite charges between storm clouds and tall objects is generally higher, which is why tall objects are often struck more often by lightning. So what can you do to stay safe when a thunderstorm is nearby? The National Weather Service recommends staying away from windows, doors, and outdoor porches, staying away from anything with plumbing, sinks, toilets, or showers, and any electrical outlet that is in your house. But their best piece of advice is, when thunder roars, go indoors. With WKBN 27 News, I'm meteorologist Adam Clayton.